Why do three-wheelers have suspension like this, and not the more simpler design like that of a motorcycle? In this video we will explain why it is designed this way, and why you should avoid three-wheelers that do not have a front suspension of this design. When you brake in any vehicle the center of gravity represented here by a blue dot, moves forwards. This puts more weight onto the front wheel and takes weight of the rear wheels. If the front of the vehicle dives down, because of braking hard the center of gravity moves even further forward. On a motorcycle the center of gravity moves so far forward when braking hard 90% of the weight of the motorcycle ends up on the front wheel and just 10% on the rear wheel. If you have motorcycle style front suspension on a three wheel and 90% of the weight going onto the front wheel makes it become very unstable as it would be like trying to balance a triangle on one of its points. Also when you turn the center of gravity moves in the opposite direction. So when you turn left the center of gravity moves to the right and vice versa. If you brake and turn at the same time the center of gravity moves forward and to the side. If the front dives down under braking the center of gravity moves so far forward and to the side the three-wheeler would be off balance. To get round this problem three-wheelers are fitted with a type of suspension at the front that prevents the front from diving down very far even under the hardest of braking. As you can see in this video, even though we are braking hard the front hardly dives at all. Please like our video and if you want to see more press the subscriber button below.